Yeah, I don't know where it's going now. Okay, there's some people coming. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Hey guys, all right, these videos always make me super nervous, but we're gonna go ahead and test out the new Smart Summon. So I am in a parking lot right now, and it's fairly busy. Like if this car is trucking down this side right here, what'll happen is that they will get very upset with my car taking so long. So as you can see, my car is over there in the corner and I'm over here waiting. So this is a strip mall. There's no grocery store or anything, but again, it still makes me very, very nervous because it's just very nerve wracking. Um, so here it is. This is the, the, the way that it looks and I'm gonna go ahead and go into the summon. And it says, uh, press and hold to engage smart summon. As you can see, tap arrows to move vehicle. Now the button says warming up. I had this exact same issue before where it will not actually connect to the car. All right, so here we go. Um, I have it dialed in and it thinks I'm out there in the middle of the parking lot when I'm actually right over here on the side. So that's one thing I've noticed. It, it doesn't really pick you up your exact GPS location in a lot of situations. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit come to me. So I'll show you pressing the button here. So it zooms in now, preparing, reverse. So it actually shows your miles per hour now. Um, so as you can see, here comes the car. So again, I have to be very careful here. Okay, shoot, here comes the car. So there are cars coming in. So this is, I'm, I'm really risking it right now. As you can see, they're trying to turn left. So the question is, should I go for it or wait for this car to come? I'm really biting my tongue here. It's taking quite a while. Really thinking that one through. And finally, oh shoot. Okay, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, come on, come on. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, where's it going? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. That's not good. <laughs> Well, I was definitely not expecting that. It seems like it took a totally different direction. I'm not sure what happened there. Um, we're gonna have to test that again uh, later in the evening where we don't have as many people coming out. Uh, I'm gonna do this test at night here in another parking lot. So, as you can see here, we're gonna go ahead and pull up Smart Summon. So my car is over there, okay? Now there's a guy that's sitting on his car right next to my car. Let me zoom in and see if you can see him. It's really blurry, but he's chilling, smoking a cigarette. I'm gonna go ahead and select summon. Just see here what it says. Press and hold the arrow, smart summon. Go to target, okay, there we go. So now we can go ahead and press this button up here. Okay, so I just changed it so it says come to me. There's my car over there, so this hopefully will go smoothly here, okay? So again, that guy's gonna freak out, but I'm gonna do this test here. Okay, here goes nothing. It's reversing. It's a good thing. The guy's like, what the? Okay, it saw that car. Okay. It's not, it's not gonna actually go around and cut through. So, let's see what it's trying to do here. Okay, there's some people coming, okay? So stopping for the people, reversing. Okay, and their car is right there. And my car is cutting in between these cars here. It's a little bit confused as you can tell. <laughs> okay, so now backing up. 
coming through. Okay, cutting through very, very clumsily. Okay, here it comes. Okay, whoa, going over that way. Here it comes. Wow, it's really slow, oh my goodness. Okay, I don't know where it's going now. Okay, now it's deciding to turn around. It's still coming to me. Okay, and there it has arrived. So that was very, very slow and very clumsy if you ask me, but it did get to me eventually. So again, I would never use this when there are other cars around. <laughs> Thanks guys, we'll see you in the next one.